Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, hi, my name is Stephanie, and for today's video, I am planning in my Go Get A Girl catch-all, and I'm going to be using Wrong Wrong's Hey Boo sticker book, I also have my Planny Thing Grid Washing, my Zicklin Kaluda, and of course, I have my Simply Smith Scrub stickers. All of the shops will be linked down in the description box below, so you guys can check them out and possibly even save some money on your order. So, let's go ahead and move these off to the side, and like I said, we are going to be using this beautiful sticker book. I love the theme. I love the color scheme. I love everything about it. So this is exactly what we're going to use. And if you guys haven't checked out Wrong Wrong's Holiday in Planner Collection, I'll go ahead and link that video at the end of this one so you guys can check it out. And remember to use the affiliate link linked down in the description box below so you guys can save an automatic 10% off of your order. And as always, I truly do appreciate that. So let's go back in here because as you can see, there are some gorgeous florals back here along with pumpkins and pink and black and orange and it is definitely right up my alley so as i was flipping through this i actually came across like a doorway but the other one actually had a fashion girl okay so i am thinking that maybe this one would look amazing on this side and i love the size so hopefully it's not too too big oh my gosh look it's gonna be perfect and i was debating about whether i should add um a washi tape like the black one down here but i mean it does look great just the way that it is but i don't know i might come back to it and then let's go ahead and grab one of these adorable little bags that way we can cover up this grateful section just like that okay so yeah so far so good and then i am thinking that i want to go ahead and grab this one there is one that has pumpkins already on it so let's see so we have this one i wish this one had a few pumpkins and this this one like this one yeah this one is just like a longer version um so I really wanted to do this one, but I like the fact that this one has pumpkins. So yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and do this one down here at the bottom. And I don't want to cover up this hydrate section, so I am going to move it a little bit towards the left. And so I think this should be good. So let's go ahead and cut this off and oh my gosh look at how beautiful this spread turned out as well and in case you guys didn't watch this video i ended up planning on the wrong pages again so yeah <laughs> happy to see that the previous spread is the one behind it because yeah that video was a hot mess <laughs> we were off to a rough start but hopefully that is not an indication of how the rest of the week is going to go. So the fact that we're on the right pages is already an amazing start. So as far as this section here, I think I want to use... Okay, so we have her here. Trick or treat yourself if you got it haunted. So I do like those. I also love her, the fact that she's like looking away. Um, and then we do have this, 100% that witch. I did like these ones because they already have those, um, those quotes there. But I mean, we could technically add our own quotes if we find another fashion girl. And look at these ones. I love those ones right there um just such great stickers in here um and look we also have the same fashion girl but with a different setup and then we also have her here but with the white costume instead of the pink one hmm okay so okay so we have her here and we could also add that other quote because it did say 100% that which. Um, let's see. Okay, I really 
really love that. Let's see how she would look. I feel like she's going to be way too tall for this area. All right, so where are my tweezers? Okay, so not too bad. All right, I am going to go ahead and place her down right there. And then I do want to find something to cover up that little section, maybe some florals. Hmm. What would be a great little addition? I love this pillow. I'm <laughs> dead inside. Eat, drink, and be scary. And then look at this page. I really love this little like candle setup with the pumpkins and then the cakes. Yeah, this is such a beautiful sticker book. And like we have we have the cat inside of the pumpkin. I really want to use some of these cakes. I think maybe the cat. The cat would be good, like maybe over here in this section. She is, well, she is wearing like the pumpkin little dress but she also well not the pumpkin right that would be a ghost that's why she's wearing the boo headband hmm basic witch there's just so many cute little um like themes that you could do within this sticker book oh look at the little ghosts oh i like those um let's see what about if we maybe do something like this. Yeah, I think that, would that be cute right there? Okay, we are just gonna go ahead and do it. And then maybe we could have another one, like right over here. And let's see about this cat, because now I'm super obsessed with it. <laughs> so he is really big. But look at how beautiful that looks. Okay. So I think that looks amazing. I want to see about this little setup, like right down here. Let's see. I love that they're all kind of clustered like this. So yeah, maybe something like this. Okay, so yeah, I think that looks amazing. Ooh, maybe we should have added some ghosts over here as well. Okay, let me go back to those cakes because... Oh yeah, and look, this one even has the ghost there. Is it the same? Okay, I feel like this one's a little bit smaller. Maybe, is this where I wanted to maybe add a little bit of washi? Hmm. I don't know. Let's test it out. I just want to grab the tiniest little piece. That way it has like a little um base especially since we actually didn't even add it on either page so i think that i want to place down the cake first let's go to the other one since it is a little bit smaller so maybe that one could go there and then this little base here i don't know let's see okay so yeah, not too bad. Let's go up here and see what else we have to work with. Look at the little um, pumpkins, the bats, the spiders. Oh, look at that to-do header. That would be so adorable. Huh, maybe we don't even have to, to use our own. And then look here. Um... 
Then we also have these pumpkins. I really like this one. Oh, and it's over here as well. Lots and lots of pumpkins. Let's see, maybe I want to add another, another cute little bat like on this side. So let's go ahead and place this one maybe right about there. And then look, all of the ghosts are basically all over the place. Hmm. Now I'm kind of debating that little cat. Maybe we should have moved him over here. Mm, let's see. Let's try it. Uh-oh. That started ripping my page. So never mind. <laughs> Scratch that idea. We are just going to keep moving along. Oh, maybe some florals. Well, those are too big. And I don't think we had any smaller ones. Yeah, the florals are way too big. And then I can't use this one over here because um, I need to put my header. We do have these mugs, Dead Inside and Hey Boo. I love the stack of books. Okay. I keep looking at this little floral. So if I move it up just a little bit, it'll um, go away from this bigger sticker. And it'll still give me enough room to have my to-do list here. So yeah, I think that looks really pretty. And now I just have to figure out what to do on this side because that was like the smallest floral there really isn't another one. Oh my gosh and then look at this goes how he's like coming in from the side <laughs> i think i maybe want to sprinkle in some of these ghosts over here too so maybe we could do that one there and let's see if we have a bigger one not a bigger one, but another one. I believe I did see them. Okay, so we have this one, but they're both facing the same direction. Okay, we need this one right here. And then this one is going to... Um, did I want them all the way over here or here? Okay. Okay. I am going to put them here. Okay, <laughs> so I think that looks super adorable. Um, oh, yeah, I still need to figure out what to do right here. Um, I do love this spider web. And actually, maybe this one can simply go all the way to the edge over here. Okay, and then how about we add some cute little spiders as well. So like that. Okay, we're, uh-oh. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I think that looks good. Let me just trim this off before I forget. And now, uh-oh, we still need to figure out this whole situation. Um, let's look at these pumpkins. So we do have this one. Maybe if we can find a black one, that would be great. And I believe I did see one, right? Mm. Or maybe not. I thought I had. Maybe it's in the beginning. So yeah. That one right there. Oh, and look, we do have florals up here. Okay, I think I am just going to go ahead and grab one of these flowers. And then these ones are the paper stickers because this one was a clear matte sticker. So we are, again, going to go a little bit higher. Okay, so I think 
I think this looks amazing. And I don't know, am I done? I really want to add all of the things, but I feel like we are okay. I don't know, for some reason, I keep looking at this cat. Maybe if I come this way, it won't be as bad. Okay, we definitely have some ripping of the page. It's definitely a nail biter. Okay, so we got that off. I just felt like it was out of place. Let's see if we can find just something that would go a little bit better with it. Hmm. We do have this other cake or maybe the stack of books. Um, we do have this floral too. Oh my gosh, this is tricky, especially, I feel like I'm, it's throwing me off because we don't have the little base going on. Or maybe now I'll choose one of these florals, um, especially because it's paper, so it'll definitely cover up that little rib. Let's see if there was anything else. Okay, so see, we do have these florals. Yeah, I feel like the base is kind of stumping me. Okay, we have this tiny little floral, but maybe we should put some pumpkins. I'm thinking of maybe this one. And then... No... Ooh, maybe like a like a spider on it or something. Okay, let's see. I definitely wanted a pumpkin, but I felt like the other one was way too big. So yeah, that already looks amazing. Let me see about that spider. And I think I want to do a paper one. Yeah, this one was clear matte. Uh-oh. I got way more than I needed. Okay, so there we go. So how did I want to put this one? Maybe like that? Okay, so yeah, I think that already looks so much better. I am really happy with that. Um, okay, so yeah, and I also did just upload my October monthly view in this planner and it was a um a breast cancer awareness spread using some dolls from a new to me shop so in case you guys missed it definitely go ahead and watch that one because I think it turned out so beautiful so now let's just go ahead and add the rest of these script stickers Okay, perfect. So now all we have left to do is add our bullet points. So we're going to do 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 1, 2, 3, and 4. So again, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 1, 2, 3, and 4. Okay, so yeah, definitely loving the theme, the color scheme, just everything about it. I think it turned out way too pretty. I am so happy that I did end up switching this because I think it looks amazing. So yeah, definitely check out all things wrong wrong. Everything is just so beautiful, so amazing. So get ready for your 2025 planner and all of the holiday stickers. But yeah, I love the way that this turned out and I cannot wait to write in it. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing and don't forget to check me over on Instagram at Stephanie Happily Plans and I'll see you next time.